Hey, this is Mirgloff Builds, and in today's video, I'm going to be building a uh, militia barracks for the town's guards and soldiers. And it's going to be right there, but before I do that, I would like to thank a few people for subscribing. Those being David Rocks 10, Predator R70, and there's also been a few people, uh, without registered accounts subscribing, so I can't really thank them by name. But uh, if that's one of, if you're one of the people who haven't, don't have a registered YouTube account, thank you for subscribing. And uh, I'm gonna begin building now.
All right, so the Thelonia Barracks are complete. And take a look at the exterior here. And, uh, well, this is actually the North Thelonia Barracks. There'll be uh, other barracks uh, stationed at other parts of the city eventually when I build them. It's a very plain building. It's uh, unordained, or uh, not unordained, uh, undecorated, I think is what I was looking for.
Of course, like all the wooden stairs in uh, these uh, sand towns and cities, they'll be replaced as soon as I upgrade to 1.3. Upgrade it to sandstone stairs. And it's basically just uh, this first floor here is just a couple of rooms here for uh, beds for the militiamen to rest. Then there's these clear open halls. They're intentionally clear and empty because, and as you can see, there's a lot of entrances here. If the city is suddenly attacked, uh, it's very easy for them to leave, to uh, rush out of the building. Those that are there, that is. This is the supply room. And at the sub level, just a small room for a uh, Meetings, announcements, uh, information, that kind of stuff. And in the second level, there's more rooms and empty space. I think uh, I think I actually may change my mind about leaving this empty. I might put some like tables and stuff. I may do the same over in this space over here. Put some. Uh, tables and stuff for uh, eating and other kind of uh, recreational like mess hall kind of things that's as I uh, show this to you guys that's what I'm thinking in my head what's missing and from here there's a sort of a balcony thing here and from here the oh crap the, uh, the building can be defended by uh, archers should the should a uh, siege arrive where the militia have to withdraw into the defenses of the uh, barracks, and they can also uh, defend it from above here as well. The crenellations don't; they offer protection, but they also don't uh, prevent the archers from firing down upon besiegers. And it's a very simple. But there isn't much to uh, go over with this building. As far as off-camera work goes, a lot of the space, including this space here, I cleared out. I mined and uh, dug sand, sandstone. You know, all this here before was a uh, a mountain. And then, of course, I've been collecting uh, reeds, made some bookshelves. And right after this, I'm probably going to collect more reeds now that I see that they're ready to be collected. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do for the next video. But uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.